Hello, Physics 246 students. Uh, this is Physics 3 Lab. Um, this is a video to introduce myself and a brief introduction to the course. Uh, so I'm Professor Glenda De Nicola. I'll be your instructor this semester. And I just want to go over a few basic things that are already available for you and whether there's anything you can do right now for your classes. Um, yes, there's something. Uh, it doesn't need to be done right now, but if you want to, those who are curious and anxious, yes, there is something. So here's a way uh, to reach out and show you what's available. Um, so here we are on the front website of the college, My MySCCC. So click on My MySCCC to log in. And uh, once you log in, you go to Suffolk Online, right? Suffolk Online again. And log in into Blackboard. That's what you need to do every time, right? For many classes, not just our classes. So here you have two important tabs, the tab about courses that you use the most, and the tab about community. You use this community tab when you want to access uh, instructor office hours, PA office hours, help center tutoring and, all, and the, it's on this community tab. Now on the courses tab, then you search for your course. That's physics 246, nine, the co catalog code of the course is 97699, right? So this is my view, it's my account, but you have your own view, search for the physics 246 there. This is our Blackboard uh, site. So in our Blackboard site, I posted here for you to see already um, a picture uh, of a page of our course outline. And you have our schedule. So our first lab is September uh, 2nd. Uh, we have a lab final on December 16th, etc. So our classes and labs will happen live uh, in real time. So always on Wednesdays uh, from uh, starting at 2.15 p.m. So you need to log in and access, log in into Blackboard and at 2.15 p.m. or even 15 minutes before that, even at 2 p.m., you can already access our enter in the, our online classroom. How do you do that? Here in our Blackboard page, you go here to this link. This is Live Classes Labs, okay? So labs will meet virtually here. So you click here and you enter on our Blackboard Collaborate Ultra page. So on the day of all, any one of our classes, you see there's going to be a black available link here, right? Right now they all look like light gray in color, but they will be black and available just like the course room right now looks available, okay? So you're gonna click on the one that is available and uh, just like here, I'm clicking in the course room and it will, there will be a clear um, link here for you to join the lab. Here it says join the course room, but join the lab. And then you see an environment very much like this. There's going to be a chat room. You're going to see my screen and then uh, instructions will come in, etc. Okay, uh, it will be live. So that's what you need to do in all our live classes. Um, uh, this, this, our Blackboard page is divided into some general information over here and then uh, some information about the lab material. This is the link for uh, uh, the actual lab classes, right? And then some other things here that I want you to explore. This is a video very superficially going through all of these so that you can explore on your own and uh, we'll go over these things in a little in more detail uh, in our first class or lab. Um, the one thing you can do right now, uh, if you choose to do so right now, there is time to do this only at the start of the semester, but if you want to do it right now, you can register and pay $10 to use this website, Pivot Interactives. You will need to enter this class key to find your specific Physics 246 class. So some of our labs will be done using this website, okay? Um, so if you go here to actually content, uh, I'm clicking here content on the um, our Blackboard site, and uh, you'd have a link for a free physics lab manual. 
um, and all lab instructions will be given to you will be free. But those in, using Pivot Interactives uh, to use these tools there, we need to pay $10 once uh, for the whole semester. So some of our labs will be there in Pivot Interactives. And, and so if you want, that's what you can do right now. There's already an activity. Once you log in and reg register, there's already an activity available there for you. It's not, you're not gonna be graded for that activity, but so that you can explore and play with it already. So as you go to Pivot Interactives, you're going to click here, it says join a class and join a class and then you enter your class key. The class key is provided here in this video, but also in your course offline, I also posted that in your course offline. And then it will ask you for your credit card information, you are charged $10 and then you have access throughout the semester. So let's go back to our Blackboard page and let's click here where it says course outline and instructor and PA schedules, okay? So uh, the course outline is right here. So the course outline is our contract, say, during the semester, right? So I invite you to read through all of these, but the information on uh, uh, about Pivot Interactives, right? And our class key and how to access, et cetera, it's here. So uh, I invite you to take a look and read through this and hopefully all your questions will be answered there already. So wait to ask questions for when classes begin. I invite you to first explore on your own what is available, okay? So here on the Blackboard site, uh, um, there is Suffolk online orientation. So they improve the materials, increase the materials, uh, some useful uh, resources over here. I invite you, even if you already use Blackboard to go and take a look. Um, I posted this um, files called how to files, how to use Blackboard, general instructions, how to study succeeding physics, how to access instructors office hours, class recordings, etc. So there's a lot of resource information you can use throughout the semester. I invite you to take a look at the whole thing. Um, the final thing I would uh, want you to start thinking about is how to have a webcam because um, many of the tests uh, through in the college and tests done by me uh, will require a webcam. So if you don't have a webcam, uh, there is a way for you to use your cell phone as instead of the webcam so that you are monitored during the tests. But um, it is a good idea to invest on a webcam. So um, the other option is, well, if you cannot invest in a webcam, um, it, at least send me an email saying, hey, um, professor, I just want to give you a heads up. I don't have a webcam. If, if needed, I will have, if, if there's no other way out, I will use my cell phone camera. But if I know that you already don't have a webcam and it's not something you can buy right now, then, um, I will find a way to investigate with the college whether the college can lend you a webcam, okay? So get in touch with me, send me an email about this soon, and, and we'll see what can be done. Our first uh, lab test, our lab midterm is only October, so we have time to, to check this out. The only times you need a webcam is for tests. You don't need a webcam for the everyday classes. So these are some of the things, uh, registered in PA, the P Pivot Interactive and the webcam that you can think about doing right now, okay? Uh, if you don't wanna do them right now, also there is time. Um, so happy readings, uh, go check out everything here and I'll see you on September 2nd. Bye-bye.